but what I will say protective is that yeah, I you mean learn. I think of course. I just think certain things have to be sacred and be protective and you have to be careful and and delicate. It's, it's just not me. It's another person, it's our kids, it's our family and and I learned that along the way. And she learned something else recently after visiting with of all people Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg who was married to her late husband, Marty, for more than 50 years. What's your piece of advice? And she said, um, it's good to be a little deaf sometimes. <laughs> and I was like, oh, okay. She's like, an unkind word. People are not perfect. Sometimes, you know, you just have to let it go. And often, Alex and I, I will now reference, like, RBG, like, stay calm stay calm or when everything gets crazy when people get out of control when there's like heightened emotions don't go there with people just stay calm that may not be easy as lopez prepares to perform at this year's super bowl halftime show in february it's moments yeah right like you just have to find special magical moments um are you and, finding and yours tonight we're, we're just in the beginning stages you know, it's coming together. We have a little bit of time still, so I'm not worried. Jennifer Lopez has learned a lot in her first 50 years. Are you happier today than you were? Yes, much, much. You say that emphatically. I do, because I realized that my journey to happiness wasn't about anybody else. Like, there was no man that was going to walk into my life and make me happy. No savior, that no. I had to be happy. It wasn't somebody else's job to love me. I had to love me. And maybe the most important lesson for her next 50 years is also the simplest. Doesn't matter what anybody says. I know who I am, and that's what I have to be. And I work on being the best person I can be every day.